This channel is based off of STEAM, which is science, technology, engineering, art, and math. This channel will run along with different experiments and examinations of all sorts of things. It will also explain how different objects and experiments work. To get started, I'm actually going to be examining something. Something that a lot of people wonder about. I personally have wondered about it for a long time. And that object is kinetic sand. Kinetic sand is sand that you can you can form a shape with and then destroy it. The way that this works is not with like synthetic fibers, but it's with it's made up of polymer chains. So the way it works is be, since it's made up of long chains of repeated units, which in this case, the units are grains of sand, um, the polymer chains within the silicone oil, uh, they help the sand to stick together, and that's why you can form a shape or an object, I guess. And, but the more exciting part of this part of this video is an experiment that is really easy. Um, and all you need are a sticky note, a marker, a dry erase marker, a towel, and a smooth flat surface. I am using a clear glass pipette. And a cup of water. So first I'm going to take my marker and my sticky note and I'm going to draw a stick figure that isn't like completely joined together. So this is what I'm going to try not to do. So I'm going to put it under my bowl so that I can see what to do. Now I'm going to take my marker and I'm going to draw a stick figure. I want to make sure that everything that I'm drawing, like all of the hands and legs, are all in contact with each other because otherwise it would all fall apart. And then I'm going to draw some hair on top. Once, this, once you've done that, you take your water and you pour it on. And since the expo marker isn't coming up right away. I blow on it so that it'll come up. And it just floats right on top of the water and it isn't breaking apart. And then, once you've done this, you take a toothpick and so once you're done with your drawing, Put it under and you scoop it up and wrap it around your toothpick. And if you want to get rid of the dry erase marker on the toothpick, if you like take it off, it doesn't get anything on your fingers. So then, once you've taken out the drawing, you take your cup and you, you dump the water from the pan or plate and you dump it back into your cup. And then you take your towel and you dry the net. The way that this works is that, the way that this works is the X 
Expo marker, it doesn't dissolve in water like other markers. So uh, when it's underwater, a strong buoyancy occurs, taking the stick figure off of the pen and lifting it up so it doesn't so magically float as some people think it does. <laughs> I hope you enjoyed this ex this experiment. I hope you will um, do this experiment at home. It's really simple. Um, you don't need a lot of things and I'm sure that if you go to school you'll probably have the supplies. So have fun with it and I'll see you next time.